Hey everyone, I hope you're having a great day. Welcome back to my channel. Have you guys ever wondered whatever happened to Dunkaroos? Well, wonder no more because I found them. So if this sounds like something you're interested, then keep on watching. Okay, so I'm going to add a little bit of a backstory. So I used to eat Dunkaroos actually back in 1999, I believe. They were just around for what seems like a very short-lived time. I mean, at least for me. I don't remember seeing them much, but I've been wondering for years and years now if they would ever bring them back. And one day when I was like at the register at Walmart, of all places, they were just there. And I just couldn't believe that they were there instead of like, I guess, in the other section. But... If this isn't an awesome impulse buy, I don't know what is. So I'm just so shocked that I came across them. And obviously I figured I would have to review them because I want to know if it tastes exactly like it used to taste. So I'm guessing a lot of Generation Xers and um, Millennials will probably remember Dunkaroo's Arrest. I'm not sure if they'll remember since it seemed very short-lived. I don't even remember seeing these in high school, to be honest. So. Okay, now let's open them because I really want to know if it tastes exactly like I remember them. Well, that's what the cookie part looks like. And yeah, I guess I do remember them being kind of round. And then the frosting, I remember them being having little um, maybe spots like sprinkles or something. It was white and with maybe sprinkles. So let's see if that it looks the same. Hmm. Well, I don't really see any cutesy poo little spots, but... um. I don't know, maybe if you mix it, but I could have sworn back in the day you used to have these little sprinkles in there, but anyways, that's not a big deal. I have my own sprinkles anyways, so well, let's find out if it's the same. Oh, if you guys are wondering, because I don't know if it showed up in, um, you know, when I first showed it, it's Betty Crocker, so that's the brand. Okay, I think I see one sprinkle. All right. Hmm. tastes great it I guess the best way I could describe it as um I guess this tastes kind of like butter cookies you know similar to that's the only thing that I could really compare it to and as for the frosting to me it tastes like regular vanilla frosting you know but it, it does taste pretty good the thing is I'm not a hundred percent sure if it tastes exactly like it used to taste because you know it's kind of hard for me to remember something from 1999 exactly but it does taste pretty good, actually. Yeah, definitely, if you're at Walmart, definitely get these. I mean, they're just, they're so good. I'm glad I got two. When I saw that, I said, you know what? I have to get two because... When it comes to things that they bring back, I've noticed that they don't seem to last very long. Usually it's one of those limited time only deals, kind of like with Crystal Pepsi. That was kind of disappointing. I'm not going to lie when they took it away. I felt like I was going through the 90s all over again when they just took it back. But these are actually pretty good. Yeah, if you like butter cookies and vanilla frosting, I think you'll like these. It's just... It has very, very little pieces of frosting. I think I just found the second piece right now. Huh. Mm-hmm. Well. Mm. Definitely gets the Jill seal of approval. This is <laughs> delicious. And as long as they don't discontinue them again, I will definitely be repurchasing because they're just <laughs> delicious i'm just shocked <laughs> shocked that i was able to find them but yeah definitely i mean i don't know where else they would have these because like i said the only place i've seen them and then of 2020 this is like the oddest thing to happen since this year has been so crazy obviously but well it's nice to have i guess a silver lining after all that rains that's they're really, really delicious, but they did have them in um, the register. I don't know if they have them in all the registers or if it's just some registers. So if you're at Walmart, you may want to look around because I'm not sure 
that they have the same things in every single register. You know, kind of like one has Coke, one has Pepsi, kind of like that. But I just happened to luck out that the one that I went to happened to have Dunkaroos because I have never seen these before. And once again, they're great, definitely. If you want to feel that nostalgic feeling from 1999, definitely get some Dunkaroos. Well, so that ends the review. Um, thank you all so much for watching. Have an amazing day. Bye.